Hey everyone, Shen Virtuality here, and we are back again with a little My Friend Pedro, Ripe for Revenge. And we're going to be hitting up the last section of this game. Uh, it should cover levels 25 through 36. Uh, I've also went back and I've made sure that I've gotten three stars on all the previous levels except for the final one. So uh, once we get there, it may take me a couple of tries, but I want to try getting the achievement for getting all three stars uh, with you guys in tow. So hope, let's hope we can uh, knock it out of the park. Um, what I also want to do is get the three stars for each of these levels. Uh, so it may even not be much new. Uh, same rules apply. Uh, be quick, make sure your multiplier gets carried over at least as much as possible and just sort of make that top score. So uh, we'll go in and if there's anything to note, I'll see about uh, sort of highlighting it along the way. But uh, with the last two episodes, everything should be pretty self-explanatory now. So these final levels will just put those skills to the test. So let's get started. Okay, now Pedro says that this is our last stop, so let's get started and get things going with uh, with getting things cleared off here. So a couple of errors and we still make it out with the three star on to the next level. Alright, well, I've played this level about 10 times and could not, I was just short for getting the three stars, so we're going to continue on 
Um, it's a pretty straightforward level. It's just a matter of timing. So uh, keep at it if you're at for that third star, but let's continue on. Here you have some single use buttons. So if you shoot them, they'll open up doors or whatever else you need. And on to the next one. You have some conveyor belts, so just time your jumps uh, quickly and you should get through it. with your jumps and you should get through this one pretty clearly. On to the next one.
middle section with the doors and the four uh, the four panels that need to get uh, hit uh, should have enough enemies to keep your combo going so just keep that in mind and there should be no problem on to the next one Easy for this skateboarding level, on to the next level. Ah, the rocket launcher. A little bit of a blessing and a curse. You'll see what I mean. Yeah, I know I took some hits there, but uh, you'd rather not be in the blast radius when you're launching your rockets of destruction. Anyway, keep up your multiplier, and this is a piece of cake. On to the next.
you're cool with the canisters and you should be able to pass this level completely. Uh, keep in mind canisters will be appearing shortly after so bear that in mind. On to the next. You know what? We got more canisters to play with so let's get at it. Level Heads wins the game. On to the next one. We got some pressure plates here. Don't let them make a fool of you. You have to be quick. Yeah, a little bit of a hit at the end, but we'll take it. On to the next one. No, more crates. You know what that means. We gotta find his wife, Maria. She's here. We're so close. We are. So, let's. We know the drill.
Hey, Drew. Hey, wait. We need to destroy that crate. Where are you taking it? Uh-oh. Our job's not done yet. Stop that truck. A banana bunch. Ha 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 ha. And we did it. That's the end of the game. Like I said, nothing too much to think about. Just some fun, endless blasting through some, you know, some rather unique levels, I would say. Um, music's top notch. I was pumped. Uh, ever. Uh, I was pumped throughout the, the entire game, so uh, I'm sort of digging that. Uh, and yeah, um, I hope that the developer uh, gets enough uh, money from selling the game to tack on some more levels or some more game modes. I would definitely pick them up in a hurry. Okay, and I apparently missed one level. Oh. <laughs> I missed one level to get three stars, so that got us the achievement, and also ranked us up on our achievement leaderboards. So, interesting enough. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much it for this is Pedro. 
Uh, you also have Blood Rush mode, which is basically timed per kill. So you start off with a certain amount of time. As you get each kill, then your total time is uh, added on to it. And you just got to reach the end of the level before time expires. Uh, no hearts or anything like that. Uh, we'll shoot through level one just to give you guys a taste of what to expect. So you got five seconds right off the bat. Get in and start shooting. Because you need to be quick here. And as long as you make it within the time limit, you're off to the next level. So we'll cancel that for now. Um, just to give you an idea, we're not going to play through that because I haven't really gotten that far. I've only gotten up to level 7 and uh, there may be... I, yeah, it looks like it takes on the entire 36 levels of it but this has been my little playthrough of my friend pedro uh, if you enjoyed the series let me know with a like leave me a comment of how uh, you enjoyed it and subscribe to my channel for more mobile gaming goodness because you'll never know what i'll be picking up next this has been shin virtuality game on have fun and we'll catch you guys in the next one thanks for watching bye